Good morning guys, excuse my morning face, I literally just got out of the bed, put some clothes on, and that's my brother's carpet, who is 8 years old, so don't judge me, I'm not playing on this carpet, but uh, yeah, I'm super excited to leave for Ireland today, my plane is departures at 7 a.m. It's currently 3 a.m. in the morning and we're leaving house at 4 So it's gonna be about an hour drive to Bratislava and then I'm already checked in uh, Packed all my stuff. I'm just gonna have to get ready and Put my food in my bag and I also wanted to tell you that for those who are traveling for the first time internationally or just traveling for a show uh, you're allowed to take food with you in your carry-on package but you cannot pack any liquid so make sure you don't have any sauces on you uh, no sugar-free pancake syrup or whatever you, <laughs> you like and um, also if you're packing any type of nut butter not sure about the peanut butter and stuff like that but uh i would probably suggest you to maybe if you have like this single serving actually have this single serving of peanut butter uh from amix nutrition they're my favorite one so i have the single serving at only 50 grams so I'm gonna try to take it with me on the plane because I actually tracked it as my fat source with a few of my meals and I also have measured out almonds almonds with me so if they take it away I still got plan B but uh, I also have this single serving with me in my other luggage so once I get there I still have my peanut butter because this girl loves peanut butter and cashew butter and all sort of nut butters so let's go ahead and get the day started uh, as I said it's 3 a.m. I'm gonna get ready uh, straighten my hair mm, pack my food and I think that's it and I'll be ready to leave alright guys I'm gonna check in with you soon and let's see what this day has for us. Another two and a half hours 
uh, on a bus to Limerick where the competition will be so I know I've been using the word excited that I'm excited so many times so if you can count it how many times I used it in this video you get an extra point but I'm pretty damn excited so yeah I'm gonna grab some coffee as soon as possible because this girl been up since 3 a.m. and I only had one coffee and that's not enough so uh, hopefully I can find a coffee shop and don't miss my bus because I got actually 25 minutes to catch the bus so let's see if we can manage that Get my coffee and I'm searching airhead guys. I thought it was nine o'clock when it was actually eight so I'm like rushing through the whole airport to catch the bus and when I get there uh, I was gonna double check the time right and then I see it's 9 in the morning and it's not 10 so I actually had the time to come back and grab some coffee and chill a little bit with you guys here and update you how it is going here well the weather is pretty crazy I mean it's raining and the humidity is probably like 90% we get this guys it's gonna be a great weekend i'm really looking forward to meeting people make friends and just really enjoy the moment stay present so the next time i talk to you guys it's probably gonna be from the hotel room and i really can't wait to lay down and eat my next meal i only ate once uh at seven in the morning but I've been up since 3 a.m. so I'm, I mean I'm not hungry but just want to keep the some time between meals for the only reason to give time for the food to get digested I want to avoid bloating as much as possible so I'm just gonna drink my water eat my meals and relax an hour later um, yeah, so the bus was supposed to leave at 10 in the morning. It did not come. It's already 11 o'clock and the bus is not here yet. So the next one is supposed to leave uh, at 12. So I just came back to the same spot to get a cup of tea to warm up. I'm on the bus, guys. Made it, made it. just can't believe that I've been on the road since 3 a.m. this morning and it's 6 in the afternoon or in the evening and look where I am at guys finally arrived finally oh my gosh I can't wait to lay down and I still got an upper body circuit 20 minutes of walk on the treadmill but that's gonna be easy and then eat all the carbs and lay down and rest, catch up on some sleep. long day seriously guys i actually stopped at the grocery store picked up some stuff because i was on the bus 
and talked to my coach and he said we need to double my carb intake for today and it's already like 6 6.30 in the evening so I really needed to pick up something that I can kind of eat and I'll show you what I got it's pretty simple everything that I've been eating until now and uh, it's really important if you're going through your first peak week uh, you wanna keep food consistent so everything that you've been eating so far you're gonna be keep continuing eating the same thing on peak week you don't wanna experiment experiment with anything new you you get seven days to make your or bring your best package ever to the stage so you can make it through those seven days you don't have to like go super crazy on any food choices or anything like that after that when you do your reverse diet you're free to do whatever you want you can switch up food uh, sources or anything you can play around with food but for those seven days for your peak week you want to stay, stay consistent with your meals so what I actually got from the store and I packed from home with this whole turkey breast and put it in a ziplock bag and just brought it with myself um, there is actually turkey breast with asparagus in here I just like portioned out so what I got from the store is honey cheerios don't judge me I've been eating honey cheerios in my entire prep and I got these caramel rice cakes and I already ate two of these they're delicious and I got this yogurt I'm not gonna eat it uh, before the show but I got it post show I got this moisturizer because I forgot to bring mine I got raspberries I've been also eating raspberries my entire prep and fruit as well almond milk uh, oats that's tooth toothpaste because obviously I forgot to pack toothpaste paste also forget to pack toothbrush so I bought that as well these are uh, already cut sweet potatoes uh, I packed the asparagus I brought it from home uh, it's uncooked so I just gonna have to like microwave it or heat it up uh, popcorn this is for post show sour cream and black pepper I got it from the airport in Dublin and just sounded so delicious the macros for the whole bag is 96 calories almost 5 fat 10 carbs and almost 2 grams of protein Egged hard boiled eggs I brought them from home and the asparagus that's gonna be my next meal and I'm also gonna have two servings of the honey nut cheerios and that's about it for now Jenna's gonna have to take shower exfoliate and just rest I also actually brought some of these protein bars that's for post show as well just to like if I wanna eat something sweet I'm gonna have these I can easily track them instead of eating like a chocolate cake or whatever these are from Amix Nutrition I haven't tried these they're the newest ones the low carb one um, the macros for the whole bar 248 calories 11 fat 14 carbs and 20 grams of protein and this is from La Gracia this is a Slovakian company as well uh, those bars are actually made out of pure like dates and uh, peanut butter and like it depends what the flavor is but it, there is nothing uh, artificial there is no sugar added and stuff like that and i also got the peanut butter from amix it's really cool it's the whole package is 50 grams so what I did for today, since I was traveling, I just tracked the whole pack, the 50 grams, and I was kind of like snacking on it whenever I ate a meal. And by the time the day ends, actually I already ate it all, but like I didn't have to measure out every, every single serving, I just had like a little bit of it, and by the end of the day it's gonna be 50 grams. 
Fun fact, the door, the entrance to the gym is between the two restaurants of the hotel. One is a steakhouse, the other one is a curry house. So you can only imagine. And it smells delicious. But let's see what is this gym about. It's all right, I mean, we get everything what I need, free weight, can stretch, <laughs> but uh, yeah, so I'm here, just gonna do this circuit and get back to the room and chill. I'm just gonna try to do pull-ups. I'm not sure how that's gonna go. I'm all cleaned up and I showered and brushed, brushed my face, exfoliated, moisturized, did all the good stuff so I'm gonna be ready for the spray tan for tomorrow but before I go ahead and make my last meal I wanted to show you something I thought it was pretty funny but uh, look so I'm just gonna have this uh, two servings of Cheerios and the label says for adults the serving size is 30 to 45 grams like don't tell me what to do <laughs> i'm an adult and yeah i want to do what i want and it's gonna be two servings which is 60 grams and i will just enjoy it and get some good night rest sleep it's actually, uh, what time is it? It's 8, 8.48, it doesn't want to focus. And my wallpaper has been this picture since I started prep and obviously the only thing I changed was uh, I used a different check-in picture from each week. <laughs> I'm such a weirdo, I edit it every week, so I changed my picture and it's just such a great motivation. So whatever the outcome will be on Saturday, I know I'm already a winner because this prep has been the best ever. So like, um, my stress level was just so low, everything was optimal and yeah i can't be happier than i am right now with everything that has been going on and just how things worked out for me for better and um that's it just grateful for everything for you guys for for my life for for i call it the universe but whatever you call it just be grateful for it that it has the plan for you and no matter what's going on right now you may take it as it's as it is negative but just stay present trust and know that it's gonna work out for better not even a better for the best for you so things happen they don't happen to you they happen for you and you just have to have 
faith and trust so yeah I'm just gonna make this enjoy it end of all these motivational speeches before I get emotional again and talk to you guys tomorrow